This is Cindy G, and in this video, we are going to assemble the Halloween treat bag. <clears throat> I have a ghost, a pumpkin, a mummy, and what I'm going to do is just assemble one of the bags, and then I'll show you the character assembly on the other two. So you want to start just by folding, <clears throat> excuse me, on your score lines. This is a small bag. Grab my ruler. I wanted to keep it small enough that it's easy to fill. Uh, it's three and a half square by an inch and a half deep. So these would be good for party favors, school, and they should go together very quickly. I haven't done it yet, but I don't see why they wouldn't. They're pretty simple. There's not a whole lot of pieces. So I'm going to go ahead and the hole didn't cut all the way out. So I'm just going to poke that through. Now there is a strap for it, but if you wanted, you could use like um, a pipe cleaner or some wire. You could even tie some string through it and have a little string handle. And I'm going to be using these crushed velvet brads. I think it will be easier to put the panels on with the bag flat. So I'm going to go ahead and put these on first. And the hole is a little bit hard to see. I tried to keep it small so if you had the, um, the mini brads that it would work. I didn't want it. Um, Because sometimes these holes can get too big for the mini brads. Oh my goodness. I don't know what's wrong with my glue bottle. I think my tip just needs some cleaning. You do, if you're using black, you want to watch the amount of glue. Don't do what I'm doing here because it gets shiny. Okay, so all of the pieces I did make, I'm going to show you the mummy on the bag because he's got the most pieces. I did make a back, a piece for the back, and a piece for the front. I 
and then one goes here and one goes there okay and this just adds a little bit of a little bit more dimension to your project For your eyes, just put your two pieces together. So I'm going to put my eyes like in behind. Um, the bandages. So I'm just going to tack them on here first. I mean, you can put them on the on top if you want them on top. I just want to put mine behind. And just kind of find a position that you like. So now I'm just going to And then what I've seen lately is a, a lot of flowers on these Halloween pieces, which I think is adorable. So I created a little flower to put on the corner. And then just goes here in this corner. And I think I'm going to pop it up with a foam dot. And these, I, I've been having to use <coughs> glue on these foam dots that I have purchased. The dots and the squares. I got these dots from Amazon. And they are definitely not holding long term so okay now i'm just gonna close this guy up put some glue here I'm going to fold it this way too, make sure the glue is good, and then I'm just going to add some glue here. And I think I'm just going to go ahead, and even though I said I was going to do all of the bags, I'm going to go ahead and stop the video and then do them individually. There we are. Let's see. I think 
I will use green for my mummy. And there it is. There is the mummy treat bag. Thank you so much for joining me.